Okay, episode, what is this, uh, eight? Yeah, three races to go. Episode eight. Got interrupted right at the end there, so I didn't get to finish explaining what I was trying to explain. I mean, I was doing a terrible job of it anyway. And I figured end the episode before I get interrupted and have to edit just to add an explanation at the end. Um, anyway, if this gives me a million dollar payout, or uh, this one gives me a million dollars, like be between the two of these being refreshed, giving me at least a million dollars, not uh, almost a million dollars, because what do I need? Um, uh, income per race is one. So I'll have, uh, so I need between the two of them to make 800,000. And then I'll be able to buy the upgrade before, by by the end of the third race, so, uh, by the end of the second race, uh, in, in two races time, allowing me to, um, um, uh, God, brain, allowing me to buy the upgrade for my uh, headquarters before the end of the season and then hopefully get it done by the start of the next season instead of um, into the next season. So if I remember correctly, I'm not answering that lowers your marketability, which I come, I think in my head is, um, they've asked you a question and you've gone, yeah, no. It makes you not, like sponsors don't want to, like, whereas if you pick one, you get controversy. Um, well, he, he, he's definitely better. Should have picked the other guy. His morale is lower. Your morale keeps going up. Whereas isn't it? the other guy's morale is at 100%, isn't it? Manage pit crew. Um, we can't hire any new pit crew. So you're, you're refueling your front jack, man. Um, you got a four on tires. Oof. Mistake zero. Um, I took the long jack. Um, either of you any good at tires? You're a Five. You're five eight. So we'll swap you with the most fatigued guy. So this guy. and we'll swap in this guy with you. Okay. Uh, wait, we are Jack. Can we? You don't matter which Jack. There we go. Eight second pit stops. Um. Oh, well, one day we'll be up there. <laughs> like that. Four, three, one. There's a 12. Oh, that race was fucking beautiful. I loved it. All right. Uh, onward we progress. Oh, well, right. Because at the end of the episode, we um, prematurely. We still have all this to, to go through because I was going like the episode's so sh short and the reason the episode was short is because I do this at the end of the episode so after the race it's like oh the video the episode's 25 minutes long and then I do a bunch of micromanaging stuff which is <laughs> sort of in the vein of um, if you don't want to watch me do the micromanaging stuff you can watch I'll start the race do the race then you can just leave the episode but of course I got interrupted so I ended the video rather than having to edit the interruption which means if you're currently doing that, I'm sorry. Uh, scouting got some done. It's got some done. Oh, okay, another race. I was going to, why did it stop? Oh, some of these races are nice and long, 16 races. So I think the season's the same length regardless of, um, of how, um, how many races are done. The season's like, you know, it's summer or whatever. Which is good for me because it means if they add it, because we're adding an extra race, we're doing 11 next season. Um, it means that there'll be, everyone will have less reliable parts in the second race than they would have if there was only 10 races because they've got 10% less time to repair parts between, uh, to upgrade the parts between races. That didn't look good. That looked like there was a race and then a race. Uh, November, December, so there's a month between these two. Uh, October, November. So yeah, March, April, May, June, July. So there's like one a month. But 
I don't know what keeps booting me out of full screen. Um, but I'm assuming it's March till December is the season. Chance of rain, 25%. Huh. That's interesting. Um, so low speed cornering, acceleration, and top speed. So we have both of these. I mean, we've still got absolute garbage um, compared to everyone else. We've got slightly better acceleration, but we've still got a worse engine than everyone else. So we're still behind. We're just not as far behind. Have I just not been improving parts? Is that why one of those pauses happened? Improve that and that. Um, improve that and that. Right, like, what, we're using these. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. So, do I even have these good parts equipped? Like, yeah, you have the two greats with the, the benefit to super, it's the soft supers and ultras. So basically you uh, can do some fucking amazing shit if given the right chance. So, uh, your car's not as good as his, according to you, so... You are losing a morale penalty. Each race. Um, uh, yeah, because you think your car is shit, and you think it's not as good as his. That should lower your morale penalty. It didn't. Okay, um... I wonder how long I've been wasting improving parts for. I'm working on performance because all my parts are reliable enough to make it through a race without needing a repair at this point, so. That should hugely increase if we boost the suspension and the um and the gearbox. Yep, okay. Continue. Alright, we're just about to enter a race. So if we can Place, yeah, no, it's not likely. Um, so it said the prediction is sunny and sunny, so we'll, we'll practice on, I guess, super softs, because that extra performance, if it's extra wear, then we can stay on super softs for longer, and if it's extra actual performance, as in like extra speed, super softs being improved by 10% is better than a soft being improved by 10% if they both last just as long, because improving 100 percent by 10% will go to 110, but improving 110% by... 10% will take you to 111, so it's an 11% increase in total. Well, 100 increased by 10% or 11, uh, 110 increased by 10%. So we need to take you because it's you you're driving and then you... Ooh, we get to do medium. Let's hope we get mediums and softs. Yes, okay. So we're doing softs. To be honest, there's no real point loading. I'm... I'm curious whether um, saving setup should be saved as um, as opposed to the actual setup instead what the track says it needs like if it's top speed and um, an acceleration you set it to this which also it said top speed was it? no it said acceleration was much more important and top speed was was helpful so we'll do that and we're gonna set you up to also use softs because I think giving him the soft advantage is gonna be significantly more important than um, than gi giving him like giving him the ten percent soft advantage would be better than the ten percent trim advantage because he has way more advantage on the soft like the softs get an even better advantage. I'm just gonna leave that. As is. Um, so yeah, and a 10% performance improvement on softs. When my softs get a hundred improvement from being fucking legends. Um, from, from being softs, basically, and having those fucking mods. Means that um, I think being on the softs because it's 10% it's either way. And I'm assuming it's 10% trim will increase overtaking and um, and cornering or something. And 
giving them tires will decrease wear and increase top speed or something like that. Um, maybe increase acceleration and top speed or something like that. So th basically, you pick tires on on drivers that are good at these things. Um, uh, I'm not running at 12 times speed. I was wondering why everything was going so slow. I, I was going like, surely they should be back by now. And then, I, um, yeah. I was going like, wow, this must be a really long track, but it's not. I'm thinking actually more downforce. Uh, as I scan through this, I keep seeing that there's a, there's a point there where it doesn't cost me time because I didn't change it. Henceforth, you should not drag either of these to the end because if you need to tweak them. Being able to tweak one. Or maybe you should drag one to the end because to be, be able to tweak the other. Anyway, so you're at great, so we want to move you a little bit. You're okay, so we probably want to go like that maybe? Maybe do that and see how well that works. Okay, send you back out in your soft. Oh wow, we nailed the downforce. Thank you for having a good engineer that can actually nail the downforce. Handling was great, so we want to tweak the speed. Probably want to go maybe more acceleration. And then tweak the speed one or the other. Yeah. Okay, let's give that a test. Okay. And okay. You, my friend, uh, I'm gonna bring you in and bring you in. I think I just accidentally let you guys do an extra lap then, but that doesn't really matter because um, you are gonna at least reach the next level of setup knowledge, which thank you uh, for basically meaning that you're gonna shrink the bars a little bit. Which, I mean, really does nothing for me because. I already kind of know where to go. So let's just do that. I'm gonna send you out for a lap. So I'm gonna send you out for two more laps, basically. So I'll bring I'll bring you in immediately after. And the reason I'm uh, going to bring it in, oh wow, it actually went down. So that was great. That's good. So it's actually maybe go that way. And that was good, and that was okay. So good and okay. So you need to actually. So you're in the right spot. Do you need to go that way? Okay, so hard on the acceleration. That was great. That was good. You've gone one step the other way. Um, and bring him one more time, because basically he's so close to being perfect that if it wasn't right, I can just go click, click, and bring him um, the other the other side. Let's just go do, do, do. And if I put him the other side um, of the line, Oh wow, he's nailed his handling now as well. And what's beautiful about him nailing his handling is see how this number didn't change. Means that that one went down while that one went up. Which, oh no, I hate it when it does this. I need to go one step that way. I need to tweak like downforce. Uh, like that, and then that, is that the right direction? So that was, so that's great, that's great but worse, that's, that's, ex okay, I think I nailed it, okay, so just push it for the rest of the way, and then we'll bring you in to one last tweak. And hopefully he'll have time to do a few laps. Okay, so we have an excellent, a great, and a great. So, we know that that's good. That's great. That's okay, and that's great. So we probably want to do that. Just give that a test and just see what we get. And we'll just leave you out. Just basically 
try and fuck that up if we can. We will hopefully be able to. And let's see where we place in terms of um Game 10. 10 and 12. Now, admittedly, it was good driver, so 10 is the one that's important because 10 means that you can actually um, probably um, you could you could place 10 if nothing else happens. So we're going to give you the soft because I'm assuming that it affects the tires, whereas this one affects the driver. And let's see. We're going to give you medium tire compound. Uh, and we're going to try. <laughs> okay, so we, uh, actually, we'll give you softs for, wait, how many laps? You get 11 laps, and you get 19 laps. And you need to get 19 laps. Wow. These must be big ass fucking laps. That was great. That was great. Uh, excuse me? I'm not gonna fuck with it because I got two excellent, but this this needs to be one, one dash the other side. But it's, it's too much work to fiddle with the fucking downforce to try and slide that bar that way a little bit. Um, so you just fucking suck, is what this is. Let's just do a fast pit stop. May as well give you softs because you're gonna... Uh, actually, no, I have to give you mediums because if I give you softs, uh, to do three pits, you would need to um, preserve tyres. But if I give you mediums, uh, it's not gonna rain, is it? No. Okay. If I give you mediums, um, what are we gonna do? We're gonna do a three stop, which means every 13 laps. So we're gonna give you uh, 13 laps of fuel, and then plus a little. 13 laps plus a little, you do a three stop with every, you're stopping every 13 laps. You, my friend, are going on softs, and hopefully your softs last longer. Hmm? Yeah. Um. Your you could do, you could do a every thirteen on softs as well. But I think, uh, yeah. Oh man. Oh, uh, but uh, no. Let's see. If we do that, we're gonna do twenty. We could do, oh wow, I wish it was the other way. I wish you could uh, uh, try and eke out a three stop and the other guy could have fucking done a two stop, but it it was, I'm, I'm an idiot, right? Like you can't make it, yeah, you can't make it 20. You're fucking, um, wear the tires too much. Um, well, we're not doing wets. Um, so you could do 13. Well, if we could try that. So, because mm, I get such a good performance boost on softs, I'm going to try a um, 12, 13, 14. See, and again, I have no idea if this number is absolute maximum or whether that number is before they start to degrade. So, we're going to do a 12, 13, 14. Let's try that. What did your actual setup end up being? 98, okay. Uh, driver style. So, you're going to go push and burn. And you are 
doing 13 laps. Yeah. 13 laps and we can push the tires a little bit. Yep, okay. Uh, so you gotta push your engine and push your tires. And go. Okay, um. So, I mean, you're going to have a huge, like, zoom. Okay. So, how's everything going? Okay, so first of all, we're going to push up the top. Uh, okay, so we're losing a lot of places, and da-da-da, and wood, and forth. And... So it's, it's really the, the pits that are going to cause us the most problems, aren't they? Because, in theory, we can finish 10th by lap speed. Um, so, how are you doing? Pushing, pushing. You're chewing through fuel faster. Storm is seven. Basically, my hope is that maybe I can cause these people in the front to try and duke it out a little bit better. So, obviously, these guys are pushing my tires a little bit harder. Despite being on a harder compound, they seem to be wearing through at about the same speed as the fucking people in softs, except that we just hit really hot. So, um, we're just chewing through tire now. Uh, drop that down. Okay. So, we still got a bunch of laps to go before. Um... Oh, wow. This tire is just degrading as you wouldn't believe. Yeah, Jesus. Alright, no, let's... If we pit now, yeah, pit now, because you're not going to get another lap out of those tires. Um, how many laps did we even make it? Eight. Okay, well, you're going to try and get 11, my friend. Um, 11. Okay, it's 11 laps with a few. You can make it an 11 and then do 10 stints, right? Do, oh god, our pit crew is shit at the moment. Oh, well, this race is probably a bum, but whatever. Um, so we're going to do that. And then we're going to... Uh, hope. Because you just you chew through the tires so much faster than I expected you to. Um, so you're on mediums, and you're, again, chewing through them much faster than I was expecting. Um, so you need to get to lap 13 and pick. You should be right to make it to 13, right? I mean, you're actually keeping up. Like, it's not like you're behind. So one extra, one less pit will actually mean that you are. Wow. One extra, one less pit might make you place above 16. Which is only really important because I need you to place above 16 so that we don't have to um, pay. Uh, so, so we have a greater chance of getting the sponsors we need to actually be able to afford our um, thing. So you've just passed the pit, so you're pitting now. All right. So I'm assuming the people in the pits are on mediums because of when they're pitting, maybe? No, they have to be on softs. Okay, so if you pit next lap, you will have enough fuel, so you have enough fuel to make it. So pit the new mediums. Fuel back up to 15. Okay, if you look at 15, I have 15 laps of fuel. And do we re do a fast pit? Because again, the more time we can save, and it's just as risky to do a fast pit as it is to, uh, yeah, okay, I get it. Worn tires. So, uh, when are you, when are you going? Um, low fuel, low fuel. Okay, you should make it, you should make it. Yeah, you could. Cool, cool, cool. We're in 16. Ex exit in 16. Cool. Okay. No mistakes. Okay, yes. Okay, okay. Um, so, you are in 12th position. Exit of 20. But, you should be a pit in front, my friend. Because everyone who's gone to softs is going to have to pit three times. Four times. We're gonna pit three times, they're gonna to have to pit four times, right? Maybe they can pit three because, as we just saw, we, we like, there's a bunch of people pitting on softs now. Uh, 
Satan. I think you pit it. Now... Okay, so you pit when you get round. There'll be 21 laps left. Did you make the 11 you needed? I don't know. We're gonna give you 13 laps of fuel. And... And we're gonna give you... Okay. Did you make the 11 laps you needed? Who knows? I think so, because I think I'm doing a 10, 10, 11, but maybe not. High on fuel, you're killing the same as you Okay. 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 I have no idea if this strategy is going to work. Um, like, e e even just from just generalized, um, tires, uh, push the fucking tires, push the fucking tires. Um, okay, okay. So they're all mediums. When we get to lap 26, we're going to pit again. Three more laps and then you can pit. Gotta try and balance those nice tire temps. We just don't want to fall behind. We're five seconds behind. We're less than a pit stop behind. Less than a pit stop behind. Directly neutral. Okay, wait, wait, wait. You're pitting now. Right? When you pit, when you get to the stop, you have 13 laps, so put 15 in the tank. Right, because we started with 15, yep, okay. So you can make it 13 laps on that. We're gonna give you fancy, fancy tires. Uh, we're gonna be able to fix this because we have, it's gonna take seven seconds and we have 11 seconds of refueling, which is just free part fixing time. And we can do it in 14 seconds. Jack it up, change the tires, refuel, pick the part, go. Okay, you have to slow down and let first place pass. Okay, so 14 laps means that you are going to catch up to at least this person and at least these two people. But are yourself not going to need to pit? Okay, so you, if I pit you now, when you get to the pit stop, there will be 10 laps remaining, which means we can give you 13 laps of fuel, give you fresh softs, and do a balanced pit strategy, and just hope that with your current setup, you will, um, I don't know, catch up, I don't know. You're going to be more than a pit stop behind, you're unlikely to catch up. You, on the other hand, uh, uh, about a pit stop behind. 16 seconds. Push your tires. So they've all pitted. And we're still behind them. So. We're probably. This is probably where we're locked in. Are we gaining losing ground? Uh. Okay. Car behind, car in front, car behind, car in front. They just overtook us, didn't they? That's what that means, yeah. Oh well, we tried. We tried. See, the strategy works, but you've got to have something like a safety car come in. Um. Hmm. Safety car, safety car. Oh, yeah, 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 stop pushing. This is the final lap, my dude. I'm not pitting for tires. 
Uh, sponsor objective. Okay, okay, okay. Um, doesn't really matter. The sponsor objective would just mean that the, um, the, the two replacement contracts I take could be smaller. Um, uh, yeah, and then the, like being a tiny bit smaller would mean that I can basically uh, take not yeah, that smaller. So I'd be more likely to get the money in time, but... Oh. <sighs> We're not likely to win any of the races in the end. Our pit crew is too small. We can't cycle it uh, efficiently. Checking cars. Oh, I didn't have any stolen part any illegal parts. So, hey, we didn't come last because this person lost two places. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, we beat Yellow by one. I mean, our combined score still didn't catch up to Yellow's. Like an other place, but you know, whatever. I wish we got money according to our points, but so therefore having not finishing last every time was better than you know, but it's not, sadly. The end result is we're still gonna have um We're still gonna finish in tenth, so we're still gonna go get tenth prize money. Um like I don't think there's anything we can do to get that money back, uh, those points back. Hey, you're not just pissed. You are still pissed, sadly. I don't know why you're losing 2.5. Maybe it's because during the practice you drove a shitty car. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we need to get 750. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, does that money per race does that have the fact that i have a pay driver manages financial skill year to date cost eh. one million year to date cost car parts oh okay um from sponsors chairman payments travel costs upkeep designer Race maintenance, drivers, next year's car. We have four million dollars stashed away. Request additional funding. It'll piss him off, but it'll give us the money right now. Fuck, right? Mm. Yeah, but I don't think we're doing good enough to. Hmm. Uh, do we piss our chairman off to get extra funding? Do we piss our chairman off to get extra funding? Mm. Maybe after the next race, because doing it now wouldn't make a difference. Because next race will only get six, seven, seven point two five. Okay, but we have a new sponsor. So yeah, we won't request it until um, until basically uh, after we've basically picked the two sponsors. If we don't get enough money after the two sponsors, I'll request money from the chairman, even though it'll piss him off, uh, in order to be able to buy the HQ this this season. Uh, you ten quick okay. I don't know why that pissed them off. I didn't blame either of them. Uh, scouting is, is returned more people. Yeah, our pit crew. Our pit crew is getting up fucking tired. Mistakes is three percent. Um, you have to go. Um, so you've got really good tires and okay refueling. So we'll put you in there. Actually, no. We should. Do we have someone with better refueling? but he's currently doing fixing. No. And we're swapping both those people out anyway. Okay, uh, you have decent tires, re decent refueling and decent fixing. So we'll actually swap you and then like that. Okay, so that gives us decent refueling. Um, we need to swap you. So we need someone who's got decent tires and you've got decent fixing. 
Okay. Lovely, 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 lovely. Um, you got a point nine, so if I can swap you out, you've got a six on tires, but only a one on refueling. Anyone else have a decent refueling? Uh, the person doing tires, the person doing refueling at the front, you have a five on refueling, 12 on tires. No, nah, I think I'll leave you in. The mistake chance is shitty, but. Okay, um, mail, yeah, okay. Scouting report finished and, and car repairs complete. Okay. So, we should gun down just a single car's parts, right? Like, there's really no point boosting, um, Yeah, just the car that gets the suspension and the new and this engine. Yeah, six days before the ro uh, six days after the race. Sponsors. Okay, we got two sponsors. We can take three hundred thousand up front for three races, or okay, so three hundred thousand is the best at the moment. That also lasts for two races, and because we're not going to be needing the money immediately. Um, we can invest uh we can we can not take it for a race um not taking either of these um we could not take it for a race and then let our sp uh sponsors uh and, yeah and and um and see if we get any sponsors next month because i'm assuming the longer you leave not taking a sponsor the more money um you can make Upcoming vote, yes, vote. Dilemma. Um, uh, wait, okay. I, uh, I wonder if you're interested in voting in favor of medium link in the next vote. I could make it worth your while, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I'll take the money. Perfect. I think that means we uh, will have enough money, right? Like that paid me, it didn't cost me, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, continue. Uh, policies, yes. Uh, you've been bribed into voting for, yeah, okay, whatever. It doesn't bother me because uh, Okay, I think it just passed, yeah. So it, it doesn't really matter uh, if the practice is longer because it just means that I have a greater chance of actually getting maximum uh, trim and whatnot. Okay, um, we might take the sponsor just because it'll mean that next year it ticks down faster. Desk, staff center, yeah, we'll continue. Yeah, because uh, basically it'll mean that what, there'll be one less race next year that needs to be taken care of. Continue. Mail. Jesus, there's just so much stuff that's... Uh, November. Oh, that must be a different race is what that is. So... I think we'll still end up being four weeks short because last time I did it, it was eight weeks left on it when I got to the next season. And obviously December is, on, uh, oh, November is a month long. No, December? Yeah, Dece November's only a month, so it'll only cut a month off of the time between the end of the season and the start of the next season. Uh, income per race. So we're still gonna do this race, uh, but that'll be in the next episode. So like, comment, subscribe, and come back for the next episode. When we are uh, we race in Milan, where uh, high speed corner, start speed, and deceleration are the important things. Uh, actually, just quickly before is it your suspension we're improving or your suspension? Your suspension. So yeah, um, okay. Yeah, you've got you've got a brakes. So in the final race, do we just go all out 
I think we go all out because the final race is going to be on the, the track that we've been customizing our car to basically do the best on, which means that we should definitely be focusing on tops um, in, in, in here. And um, yeah, you can leave um, if you. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything important. Uh, it's going to do that, and we're going to do that. And so that. Why? Because literally I'm gonna get to the final race and final race is gonna be uh, most important thing, acceleration. Top speed is useful. High speed cornering is everyone's on equal footing. So <laughs> basically I'm trying to have the best acceleration um, better acceleration and better top speed so that we actually have a slight chance of being able to uh, win better than last, but unlikely, but you know, why not? Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next episode.